The theme of violence is another theme in which um, photography has been used in an invasive way. And uh, we decided to examine this as far as we could historically to understand the phenomenon. It starts really with looking at uh, pictures of, of soldiers who had died in the Civil War. In the 19th century, the, um, the pictures of, of the Gettysburg dead were so, um, were so much of a draw to the public that it was a kind of unholy spectacle that, um, that um, people seemed to need or to desire deeply to go witness. The early stereo views of the Civil War dead were made by the regular Civil War photographers um, who were simply documenting the, um, the war. But there were notices in the um, newspapers of the time that call attention to the tremendous fascination of these pictures in a way um, that, that recognized both the horror and the, I guess, the fascination of horror. I think looking at um, violent pictures and looking at sex pictures are very, very similar. I think they're both forms of voyeurism, especially people dying. Pictures of people dying, I think, are, are made for the same kinds of essential reasons as pictures of, of sex, because it's something very mysterious to us and something very essential to us as human beings. It's a, it's a deeply private but very mysterious moment, sex and, and death, or, or period of time. Um, so I think they're extremely similar. And, um, and I think as we have become more explicit generally in accepting pictures of sex, we've also become more accepting of pictures of violence. So, so there's a kind of pervasiveness of both of these subjects.